PowerShell 2018 also has a new tool that allows you to extend multiple primitives in a single operation. To see this working, what I'm going to do is to manually segment this mesh to create some simple primitive planes. I'm going to make sure that my fitting method, my surface extension angle uh, distance is set to zero. I can then start selecting regions and fitting planes into those regions. That's a little too big, so change that one a little. And you can see that these planar surfaces that I'm creating are quite small compared to the actual part. They certainly don't intersect each other nicely. I have here some other surfaces that I've created in advance. I can now select all of the surfaces, deselect the base at the bottom, and then come to the Edit tool and choose Extend Primitive. I can either enter a distance, or I can simply drag the slider to make sure that all of those surfaces fully intersect one another, which will make it much simpler when I go to create my solids. So I can now select all the surfaces, come to the solid toolbar and say make a solid by automatically trimming. And here is my new solid. And I can begin immediately to add the fillets necessary to finish the part.